welcome back to our channel good morning good afternoon good evening your time thank you for your continued support guys subscribe to our channel if you haven't and turn on the bell so you do not miss our new upload welcome our new members to the old ones god bless you how are we all doing today happy new week to everybody is another sad one there was another attack at Uzua Kodli, Abia State. Guys, the government stormed into the police station early hours of today and raised it down. You heard me right. Here is the full details of what happened. Please subscribe to our channel if you haven't. Do not forget to turn on the notification bell so you do not miss as we bring you more updates. Let me know your thoughts in the section below. I'll see you on my next video. Please watch. All right, uh, we are right here at the Uzuakwale Divisional Police Headquarters where there was an attack earlier this morning. As uh, of course you can see right here, these are some of the burnt vehicles right here at the uh, Divisional Police Headquarters. So trying to get a glimpse of them the reports we gather is that uh, in the early hours of this morning and so and i started shooting at the police so right now we, we're taking a look at these are some of the cars some of the cars burnt and you know, as you can see this one our boss now boss the uh, according to reports we get from uh, uh, the sources here they say the men come around 2 30 2 30 for night and then uh, the come start with the shoot back. Maybe we'll see what of it try get more glimpse of what they happen inside. At the moment, we're inside the we're inside the compound where the matter happened. The guy for here just tell us say that to that we try see what of it walk enter inside. Make we get some images so far. Okay, if you look well, this is not the nine BDs. First hand, this one at Uzuakoli Police Divisional Headquarters for Uzuakoli, then the local government here for Abia State this morning. As you see, so the roof, they don't burn them, they don't burn them. See, you don't see this is not building, this is not a generate, generator we don't burn. But then the good news we say that say nobody die, police no die. The police been they able to repel them quickly as much as possible. So now just a few of them they here and I saw them try. Take make sure say everything go well. See I'm, see I'm ashes, the roof, everywhere. And people office be this so. See I'm. Just this morning at 2:30, and uh, of course you go take no say in the recent, recent times for southeast uh, these attacks don't they come one too many. Just yesterday we hear one for Anambra today early this morning at 2:30. Now for Aba, for Uzwa Kali Abia State. Now this one happens. So if you look down there, you go see some other cars with them born to, you know, cars, motorbikes, you know, unknown gunmen. I so then come, can't do do this attack right now. Make we just take small stroll again enter inside see ya maybe this don't see ya maybe this so it's everywhere they deserted right now burnt 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 everywhere burnt to ashes as it is right now make we see what our feet go inside it go outside again see ya then burn everything burn everything the fan self this one is serious. Okay. Now they, now they compound with this. Try to take a, a view again of some of the of some of the Bus bonds. See ya. So then bond this one so. I so then bond this one so. So now we'll do with this so. I could see what our fit. Get other information around here. This is not a kekenape. 
Kaken a pepper them bomb. Two thirty. Two thirty. For morning. Early this morning. And this one happened like this. So. So. But so far, so good. We don't get the cooperation of the men where they here. We don't give us access to this place. Make we see for ourselves. First hand. This morning we heard that uh, a police station was attacked by on um, a police station at Uzaka was attacked by unknown uh, gunmen. I don't know. Uh, is that true? Tell us about it. Thank you so much. It's really unfortunate that this morning at about zero two five eight hours, one of our police stations. Precisely, Ozakoli police station came under attack by yet to be identified armed men. The men on duty were able to repel the attack to an extent. It got to a point that the that the attackers resorted to the use of rocket launchers and dynamite to suppress the efforts of the policemen on duty, thereby setting the police building ablaze as well as vehicles parked within the premises, including one, one of our operational vehicles. It was set ablaze together with some um, other ones, some are exhibits, some belong to the officers, including motorcycles and tricycles. To the glory of God, no life was lost, and they could not succeed in cutting away our firearms. For, for, for now, uh, uh, any arrests? There is no arrest <coughs> now, but we are making efforts to ensure we get at the root or get the people that are behind this dastardly act. And we're also calling on members of the public who have credible information that will help us unravel those behind this dastardly act to come forward and give us the information so that we'll be able to serve them better. A few, few days ago, uh, there was, uh, do I say, uh, a rumor that uh, some people are preparing to attack some strategic uh, offices in other states. And I know that police must have had that room more. Uh, what actually happened? Were, were you taken on our ways? If we were taken on our ways, I don't think those policemen who were on duty that repelled the attack would have been able to put in their efforts. They tried, and that is one of the, the dividends of being at alert while on duty. In other words, being proactive. Like I told us, when they noticed that they could not get to their, their target, they now resorted to the use of dynamite and rocket launchers, which they threw at that building, the building, the, the, the building went at place. Okay, um, people are for long now. These uh, unknown government have been unleashing attacks on police formations and other vital um, national infrastructures. Why is it taking the police too long to arrive people behind this dastardly act? Police will work with information and intelligence. And that is why we have been calling on the members of the public. Because police, we cannot be everywhere. We are calling on members of the public because we believe that all the people behind all these dastardly acts, they, they came from homes, they have parents, they may have wives, and they should have siblings. Let 
anyone that is a true Nigerian, a patriotic Nigerian, come up with information that will help us. We cannot do it alone. We can't do it alone. Security is a collective responsibility. So you play your own role, we play our own role. And you see that everywhere will be secure. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Does it mean that as, as of now you don't know the perpetrators who committed this crime? You don't know. The police does not know. I told you yet to be identified. Yet to be identified. If we have identified, we'll tell you these are the people that are behind the dastardly acts. Okay. So that is why investigation has commenced. And the impulse of that investigation is to help us unravel people who are behind these dastardly acts. Okay, so were there inmates at the police cell? As yes. In, how many I, of them? I was told that there were two suspects involved in a cases of a malicious damage. I mean, assault of Keshanehan and the malicious damage that were let out of the book by the people. Okay, sir, we well, yesterday this morning, how many people come around that area to come and also lend support? What level of support are you getting so far from the Nigerian army on this situation, the insecurity in the southeast or maybe well, I don't have that. I don't have that in my record. But all I know is that there has been a cordial relationship between the police and other sister security agencies. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. This is the police public relations officer of Abia State, SP Geoffrey Obona. They talked to us about the latest development. We have for Zoakoli this morning, 2.58 a.m. Now they call attack that place. Thank you so much, sir.